My father-in-law had passed away. We did like an end of life, so we're all at his home as he was passing away. And that night, someone lit our uh, the trees on fire in front of the house. And then, um, so like it turned into this big ordeal, you know what I mean? Like the fire trucks are there, police are there, different neighbors' houses are on fire, you know what I mean? Like they're lighting the houses up. And so uh, it was probably about a week later that we got the report back. The officer goes, okay, the reason why you were targeted, don't worry, it's no one targeting you guys. Because you always got to wonder that, like, hey, did someone know that I was there? They don't like me. They got pissed. I beat their favorite fighter. You know what I mean? Like, is there sending animals? Right, like, right. why would you light my, the front of my father-in-law's house on fire? You know? And it came to find out it's because we had an American flag outside the door. Are you serious? Yeah. And so everybody's house got lit on fire. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, yeah, American yeah. flag, right? And they're like, yeah, you, you know, it was just a bunch of kids in another country claiming BLM, like that, you know what I mean? Like, you know, and, and just being idiots. And I'm like, you know, so, the, you know, the, the flag's a sign of racism. Right. And that's when I really, I wanted to step in and go, wait a minute, man, how did the American flag ever become a sign of racism? Yeah. What? Was like, it? I missed it that was. memo, you know what I mean? This like, is a big oppression symbol somehow. Yeah. Like, I, I, seriously, I made, I, the other day I told the, the wife, I said, I'm going to buy myself a, uh, a Prius and I'm going to put a flag on the bumper. Just fuck with everybody. Yeah, everyone's <laughs> like, oh, it's like short-circuiting <laughs> liberals, you know? Which like, way does oh. this guy go? No, but that just shows you, like, why all of a sudden is the American flag a sign That's for, crazy. Like, right, like, why? Yeah. I'm like, because my father's from a different yeah. country. He has a flag on his truck, you know what I mean? Like, he's extremely pro-America. He's like, hey, dude, I was born and raised somewhere else. I love it here. Yeah, you know I mean? like I mean, do we have our issues? Well, yeah. What country doesn't have right. problems we can work yeah. on? But like, but as far as like, I don't want to move anywhere else. And everybody, that every asshole that tells me they're like, oh, I'm like, bro, you don't have a passport, do you? <laughs> everybody I know with yeah. a passport really loves America. Because I mean, you travel and go anywhere. I mean, I mean, hell. I mean, like, I, I come back. I mean, even from you know, I mean, obviously you go to UK area. Right? It's you know, pretty much America with an accent. But like, for the most part, you know, I mean, you go most places. Those are you know, dangerous places. Yeah, there. no, there's some places I've traveled in South America and stuff. I look around like Jesus. You know, people, oh, poor people, like, no, 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 I've been around poor people. Our poor people have cell phones and get to eat at night. No, there's no such thing. We don't have them in America. You know what I mean? Like, right. <laughs> I've been places where people, like, eat it dogs is. and shit. I, like, watch them. I'm like, oh, my God. 